Hello. Want to know how much sugar is in your packaged goods? If yes, then this video is for you. We must understand that one of the goals of food brands is to make you love their products. Because it will surely benefit them more if you buy their products again and again. Some factors to consider here is that the food product must taste good, must be kept at a competitive pricing, then keep them profitable at the same time in order to continue and improve their operations, then to expand their market reach. So how did the food product industry effectively maintain these factors? In that matter, one of their good options is sugar. Because it costs low and many people get addicted to its sweet taste. What I mean here is the added sugars or free sugars. Because there are also sugars found in whole fruits but those foods are a lot safer because it contains lots of fiber. It has been discovered through scientific studies that sugar was one of the main causes of obesity, tooth decay and type 2 diabetes. While more details are found in other scientific researches and it's been discovered that sugar is also linked to mental health problems, cancer and heart disease. It's all right to eat sweets but it's advisable to avoid too much sugary treats and too much processed foods in your diet because your health might be at risk. Because the ideal daily intake of added sugars according to World Health Organization is around 25 grams or around 6 teaspoons or less. The smaller amount of added sugars, the better the health benefits. And one of the factors why these health problems arose is because many food shoppers are not aware on the amounts of added sugar in the processed foods that they purchased and consumed. Good thing the FDA has announced the new Nutrition Facts label for packaged foods to help the consumers have more informed food choices. And the updated details are as follows. Larger and bolder font for servings. New added sugar detail. Nutrients required was changed. Updated serving sizes. Larger font for calories. Updated daily values. And new footnotes. Can you limit your added sugar intake by just 6 teaspoons or less daily? If you can reduce it less than that, then it's easier to stay fit. So let's check through this product list with their estimated added sugar content, to know how much you need to adjust if you want to lose weight or stay fit. Then, at the end of this list, we will give you tips on how to hit the daily goal of less than 6 teaspoons of added sugar. Note, added sugar contents may vary depending on the product brand, variant and market location. These may be the most sought-after beverages in the world but you must be aware of the added sugars. Sodas are already known to have much sugar but when it comes to fruit juices, many might get shocked. Although it comes from fruits, still the small amount of fiber is the problem so it may be not as healthy as you think. While the energy drinks may provide you with some emergency strength but remember that much amount of it will also load you with lots of sugar. Now let's look at the next category. You may not believe this but still these has such amount of added sugars. Having these foods in your breakfast meals is undeniably of less effort. Yet we cannot avoid some health-linked consequences by simply taking large amounts of these options. At least now you know the sugary price of it. Maybe you should improve your daily breakfast plan from now on. Have you already exceeded the ideal daily sugar intake? Please let us know by your comments below. Next category please. Let's see how tasty these details will be. Added taste to foods is pleasing. Just make sure that it's healthy.
Looks like these are the favorites of many kids. To those who love these foods, be so much careful. Because these sweet treats are truly delicious so high levels of self-discipline is necessary. Seems like sugar is almost everywhere. Now that's too much of the sweet stuffs. Can you really handle this? But wait, there's more. Because there are still other sugary food products out there that are not discussed here and for sure, those also has unexpected amount of added sugars. Before we give the tips, you know that we will upload more videos soon. Subscribe to our channel so that you won't miss our updates. Tip number 1, Sugar Names. You might already knew that the ingredients list is arranged from the ones with the most weight going down to the ones with the least. Try to look at the first three ingredients in the list. If sugar is there, then the product has much of it. But if not, try to look at the remaining ingredients. Because sugar also has other names. The product will still have a lot of added sweetness with the use of sugar in the label of other names. Tip number 2, Label Clues. The written label of the product itself, may give you more clues on the content of it. For example, if you see the word non-fat, or low-fat in a food product, there's a big chance that it has a big amount of sugar in it. Because many foods without fats doesn't taste good. So if a non-fat or low-fat food product became so delicious, there's a chance that sugar is the trick. And if you see other catchy labels, like gluten-free, all-natural, less cholesterol and more, just check carefully on the ingredients and nutrition label of the product. Because chances are the ingredient lineup is just adjusted in order to meet the target product taste. Tip number 3, Get Hooked to Cook. Cooking your own meal is one of the best solution for you to cut off big amounts of daily sugar intake. In this method, fruits and vegetables will be your best allies because of the fiber content. Now that's what we call real healthy foods. It's better to solve the health problem through prevention rather than to wait for the disease to materialize in your body. It's just a matter of self-discipline and consistency on right diet and activities then it will be easier for you to maintain not just your own wellness but for your family as well. Hope you appreciated these details. Have you learned something useful? Please click the like button for us to see your appreciation. Thank you very much for watching and see you on our next videos.